I have completely forgotten how much of a holiday jam Hogwarts Legacy truly is, everything about the setting of the game and all the way to the simplest character detail. Playing this at 2 o'clock in the morning in complete silence and peace while exploring its large open world, engaging with numerous different characters that have a variety of different accents, whether it's Scottish, British, all of them have different personalities to them. This game has completely exceeded my expectations with aesthetics and just overall a great gameplay system. I had already expected this game to be phenomenal, especially at first stages coming into it in terms of absolutely everything and yet somehow it managed to pull me back in and revisit its universe yet once again in 2024. I'm pretty sure Hogwarts Legacy was the best selling game of 2023, at least according to the internet it is. And if that statement is 100% accurate, honestly I wouldn't be surprised because I truly believe it has earned its title. Even while exploring I couldn't help but to simply stop and try to sink all that beautiful scenery in because it is truly spectacular in that regard. I know this game isn't everyone's cup of tea, but for those of us who find this game fitting, oh do we appreciate the detail and the absolute beauty of it. I don't know, what are you guys playing this time of the year? And also, for those of you wondering, yes, I did indeed get myself into a Hufflepuff group. I know some will argue that it's a boring group of them all, but to my knowledge, they were a very loyal bunch, so I have my respect for them. And I really don't feel like I've been misplaced. And since we crossed that bridge of the conversation, let's also acknowledge the fact that the game literally has you take the test before playing to identify which house would be more fitting for you. And depending on which house you join, it will slightly mix your quests in the order that they come with. Just the overall idea behind Hogwarts Legacy has been completed with so much thought and planning while developing this game, truly delivering something completely new to the table. Let's also not forget that they are making a new Hogwarts Legacy game and it has been confirmed. Now we don't know as to whether this game is taking place before the first one or prior to the first game, but nonetheless it is in the making. And if they used the same recipe as they used for the first game, I really don't see them messing things up too much or at all. I imagine they would have a whole new list of characters as well as a new gameplay loop and system to explore. Obviously this is only me making predictions, but nonetheless I'm super super pumped and excited about it. <laughs> 